fourth core principle is around integrating and measuring the program in the broader organization the way you would with any other business initiative. If you're asking a leader to display different behaviors or lead differently on the job, uh, the leadership development program is an important element of that, but not sufficient. You also need to look at how are the incentive systems lined up? How is the organizational structure? How is the uh, operating model and roles and responsibilities? If you're asking a leader to be more inclusive in decision making, um, but not giving other people the authority to make decisions, as an example, or vice versa, you're asking an, uh, a leader to be more collaborative, but they're in very strong functional silos with KPIs that don't actually align across the different, uh, the different parts of the organization. It's very hard for a leader to then be successful. I remember once being engaging in a conversation how we could help an organization on transforming the leadership capabilities of their top 200 people. And this was where we're talking to the learning leader. And the learning leader was saying, well, I need to do a development, a leadership development program, but there are three other work streams. There is a culture work stream, there is an organizational structure work stream, and there is a performance management work stream. I don't know exactly what they're doing, but we're gonna focus on leadership. And my answer was, well, unfortunately this won't work. So either we take it all together and we try to be coherent across these four work streams or there's no point in doing this work. If the insist incentive systems doesn't encourage me to exercise those behaviors, I will not. If my authority level is not such that I can carry out those behaviors, I will not. If the organizational structure forces me to behave in another direction, I will simply not. Linked to that, there's also what we call communication and conviction. Individuals have a very hard changing their behaviors if there's a cognitive dissonance, if what they're asked to do goes against with what they ultimately believe to be correct. And if the leadership development program cannot convey the importance and the rationale for changing the ways of leading in that organization, it also doesn't work.